I'm Roy from Roy's Garage. Today I'm going to be working on a 2003 Toyota Corolla 1.8 liter automatic. Car came in, engine running rough, lack of power, check engine light is on. So first thing to do is scan the computer system. So first I'm going to be hooking up my scan tool to the OBD2 connector. Should be right around here. Okay, so I'm going to be turning my ignition to the on position. Two clicks. And so now I'm going to be reading my scan tool. Okay, so I'm reading the code. It says P0301, cylinder one misfire detected. So we're going to be uh, looking at number one cylinder. The most common problem on these vehicles is going to be the ignition coil going bad. So just let's go try at least change the ignition coil and see what happens. These are the tools I'm going to be using today to do this job. A scan tool, quarter inch ratchet, quarter inch extension, 10 millimeter socket, flat tip screwdriver, anti-seize and dielectric grease okay so first we're going to be removing this plastic cover removing these two nuts okay so this is number one cylinder with the number one coil pack so let's try change this coil pack first because it is a common problem on these Toyotas. So first I'm going to be removing the electrical connector. So with a little screwdriver, I'm going to be lifting up this tab and pulling this connector out. Okay. So I'm going to be removing this screw. So I'm going to be pulling out this coil. So I'm going to be putting in a new coil. Putting my connector on. We don't have to bolt it up yet. What I'm going to do now is start up the vehicle, see if it runs smooth. Okay, I'm going to start up the vehicle. Yeah, the vehicle runs really smooth now. Yeah, so that's the problem. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to change all of the coil packs. If one going to go bad, the rest is going to go bad. These are the parts I'm going to be using today to do this job. I'm going to be replacing four ignition coils. And this came in a four pack. So I'm going to be removing the new coil pack, removing the electrical connector, okay so I'm going to be putting some dielectric grease right in my coil. Okay so I'm going to be putting it back in. I'm going to be bolting it down, but I'm going to put some anti-seize on top of my bolt. Put some dielectric grease onto my electrical connector and then clip it onto the coil. And then the same for the rest, we're going to be placing the rest of the coils. So removing this bolt.
pulling out the coil. Put some dielectric grease in my coil. Okay, putting it back in. Okay, so in order to remove this number three and number four coil, I'm gonna have to remove this nut and this wire harness, I'm gonna have to lift it up. Okay, there's another one right here. So I'm going to be putting back this cover. So I'm going to start up the vehicle again. Make sure it's running good. That's yeah, running real good. So now I'm going to reset the check engine light. Okay, so I'm going to be plugging in my scan tool again. Turning the ignition key to the on position, two clicks. Okay, so I just erased the code. So that's how you replace ignition coils. If you have any questions, comment below. Make sure you subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. And I see you in the next video. Aloha.